I notice those fellas over there were using the E chord a lot, get that bass out of the guitar. I just use a capo and play up the neck sometimes, but uh, there's certain times when I still want a bass note that I can't get out of a certain position. So it's a little trick, I don't know where I learned it, but uh, it's where I get that bass to ring while I'm picking up on the neck a little bit. See, he has his capo on just partially. You're leaving the... Yeah, I'm left the fifth, the sixth string is open. Mm -hmm. If you use the banjo capo, it fits perfectly. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, these V-necks might slip off. <laughs> I think I'd try to pick you an old gospel number that Jane and I recorded that came from Byron Parker's Mountaineers. Some old group that did gospel songs and played it in as a string band. And then we worked it out with <coughs> guitars, and she would play the uh, the second position capo with the D position fingering to be in the key of E. But that was getting, we were leaving out the bass part of the sound. And I wanted to play my little lead part up here on the fourth fret in C fingering for you guitar players that are following me. But then uh, we still was a kind of a thin sound, so I came back and come back and rock over on this bass and still be able to play out of this. So I still get my chord. Anyway, this is called I Love My Savior. Jesus is mine, I love my Savior. 